Good morning, Modern Steaders. Do you see that white stuff? Do you see that white stuff? Yeah. Ah! It's snowing out already. Look. See my breath? Nope. Oh, a little bit. Look at all that snow. Man, our pumpkins are covered with it. Yep. Ah. Uh, Figaro doesn't like it, does he? No, he no. has no idea what it is either. Yeah. The ducks don't care. The ducks don't care, nope. Here it is, the middle of October. Yeah. And we're already getting snow. Oh, I don't like this. It's way too early. Oh, it's like a cruel, cruel joke somebody's playing on us. Look at that. I think it's only supposed to be 34 for a high today. Right now it's 28 degrees out. Good morning, girls. You staying warm in there? I hear you making noise, but where are you? So cold, you girls don't want to get up, huh? Burr, huh? Yeah, burr. Watch out! Here, you get down. There you go. What do you think of the cold weather there, Willow? Do you like it? Well, I knew it was supposed to be cold today, but they weren't calling for snow. <sighs> Nobody was expecting to wake up to, I don't know, about a quarter to a half inch of snow. I think there's about a half inch of snow on the stairs, and I'd say there's a light dusting to a quarter of an inch on the ground. Olivia was not impressed. But she was excited to wear her new winter jacket today to school. I can hear moose this morning. I wonder if we got anything in that trap we set. Hope we don't. But if we got any critters running around, I hope we caught them. If that makes sense. How's that chaff, hey? Is that good? Looks like it, huh? They have buttercup. I'm assuming that they ate their hay from yesterday, and they did. They've been eating about that much hay every day. And I'm glad they've been bulking up and getting ready for this colder weather. You all done? Did you eat it all? Nothing in the bucket. Go ahead. This has to be Buttercup and Blossom's first time seeing snow. They're coming out in it. What do you think? Huh? What do you think? Blossom's like, oh, I don't want to go out there. Nope, I'm not having it. You better get used to it there, Blossom, or it's going to be a long winter. What's the matter, Willow? You don't want to come out in the snow? Wow, that wind is some fierce. Burr. Morning, guys. I 
I just got done taking care of the goat's milk. Before we go feed all the other animals, I think we should let the excavator warm up for a little while before we start using that this morning. Oh, you all decided to come out and eat some hay? Be curious to see how the drone likes this cold weather. The battery in the drone normally only lasts 15 to 18 minutes. And like camera batteries in this cold weather, they get the battery life gets cut down good. So I don't know what will happen with the drone. It might only fly for about five or 10 minutes. Turn the heat on, get it warmed up in here. What usually ends up happening to us here is we'll get a couple of snowstorms like this here and there and we don't really end up getting too much hard snow until after Thanksgiving, hopefully. <laughs> we'll find out. Uh, I got, I called up earlier during the week and I got Gina's car scheduled to get her studded snow tires put on. Come on, I'll feed you down here. You coming? You want some grub? Let's go. And I'm curious to see if we caught anything last night in that trap. If we did. Bet you they had a cold night. Let's see. I'm not seeing anything. I guess we got skunked, guys. That's not a bad thing. Huh, nothing. I still see the egg and the bread. I don't know if it got moved or if it just got wet from the rain. I bet you that bread got wet from the rain the other day. I cleaned the snow off the solar panel. I think this is the first time you girls see snow too. What do you think? Huh? What is that? Oh, Moose, you didn't like that cold stuff, did you? Oh, Moose, you didn't like that cold stuff, did you? The chickens don't know what to think. Ah, too funny. The chickens are like, ah, uh, what is this white stuff? I don't want to come out. It's not cool. They want to stay up against the chicken coop where it's mostly grass. Well, I guess we better break the ice a little bit. There.
I'm much harder to find everything and know what I need to plow over and smooth out and what's a rock and what's not. But I want to get this all, my goal is to get this all graded and raked and seeded with like a winter ride before winter gets here. It's snowing out. I don't know if you can see all those snow flurries or not in the camera. See that? It's not supposed to be doing that today. It's only October. started working down here around the property line. 
property line goes straight here. I got an angle to that back to the road. And then we shoot back out to the big pasture. But uh, we started getting pretty muddy over here. If you can see how deep I sunk and it's filling in with water. So all this area, the water from up there is running down and getting pretty mucky. It was a puddle here. I drained it. I put some stones in a ditch right here. But hopefully it'll dry out a little bit more in here and I can get this cleaned up. All this rain we've been getting this year hasn't helped us out here. How's your new winter coat? Awesome. Is it keeping you nice and warm? Yeah. Yeah. I'm hot right now. You're hot right now, oh my goodness. Well, I mean I'm warm. You're warm. I, like, I don't even feel any cold. That's, That's good. That's good. What are you fuzzballs doing, huh? So now we got it cleared out down over here. You want an afternoon snack? Warm you up? Andy's like, I want to get in there. You're not gonna fall. Yes, I am. You got it. No, I don't. Oh. It's frozen again. I'm stuck again. Guys, I'm stuck again. You're stuck. Oh my goodness. So close. There you go. That works. You open it first. Why? Because I want to know if they're going to be fast. If there's a skunk, I want it to spray you. No. So I'll stand over here and then I'll get you first. <laughs> ah! <laughs> no skunks. Everybody keeps commenting and saying, why don't you do your mashed potatoes in your Instant Pot? I never thought about it. Let me show you what we're doing. So tonight we're gonna try it. We got seven potatoes in there, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Two cups of water. A little bit of salt. Supposed to cook them for 20 minutes, take them out, and the skin's supposed to fall right off. Let's find out. Let's see how it went. thing about using the ricer is you're not even going to take off all the skin. I just take off one side, put it skin set on the side that I took the skin off of down, rice it, and I can just take the excess skin off after. That's the way to mash potatoes. Cut up some butter. Goat's milk.
I just want to encourage everybody, if you have a chance, take the opportunity and just sit down, whether it's every night, once a week, just sit down and enjoy a good family meal. Catch up with everybody, see how their day went, share what inspiring things happened with you, and ask them what inspired them for the day. Just want to thank everybody for coming along on our journey with us, and we'll see you right back here tomorrow at Lumna Acres, a guide to modern homesteading, self-sufficiency, and freedom. Bye.